Just talking about that snow. Fox 19's Bruno Ordonez was in the storm tracker this morning, checking on conditions and talking to people in the area. Well, it feels like a winter wonderland here in Lebanon and other towns northeastern of Cincinnati. Now, the snowfall that was has pretty much ended this morning, but it left behind a nice pillow of snow here that you can use to create a nice snowball. Grew up in Cincinnati. White death is always the fear. It never comes. <laughs> but not this time. Margaret Eddingfield and her husband Josh say they were surprised when they left their Anderson Township home this morning. It was raining where we were and as we we're coming up, you know, got on 75, got towards Westchester, we started to get a little snowflakes. Those little snowflakes created a thick layer of snow in many towns northeast of Cincinnati like Oxford, Lebanon and Middletown. Just woke up and it was white. I got so much snow on my vehicle that I don't know if it's new snow or the snow off my hood that's hitting my windshield. While snow and slick driving conditions typically go hand in hand, Mike Lasore, who's from Waynesville, says the roads weren't too bad. Everything was pretty smooth. You know, I mean, there's no traffic. A couple salt trucks out, you know, doing their doing their business, and then. Uh, yeah, everything was pretty smooth, you know, I didn't really see any slick spots. The Ohio Department of Transportation say they had hundreds of salt trucks and plows out overnight and into the morning. Those trucks were mostly in northeastern counties. AAA General Manager Scott Bryant tells us they had all their crews out this morning ready to respond if cars needed help. Luckily, there wasn't a mass influx of calls but that they were prepared for. Bryant says the calls they did receive mainly came from the north side past the 275 loop. The were just people that had sit, hit slick spots on a turn and had just gone off the road. Temperatures are expected to drop in the coming days, which could bring some more icy patches on the road, causing some residents to plan ahead. Maybe leave a little bit earlier, you know, five or ten minutes earlier if I have to. Uh, make sure my air, my tire, my air and my tires are, you know, properly inflated. My, my vehicle's warmed up. Everything, all my fluids are properly. That way I ain't got to worry about sliding off. Now, Brian says that crews are preparing for Monday as he says that roads are expected to be a little slicker due to those low temperatures. He says commuters heading out on that day should not leave their home with less than a half tank of gas. He says if something happens on that day and they need to wait for AAA assistance, they need to keep their car running in order to stay warm. Reporting from Lebanon, I'm Brenda Donias, Fox 19 Now.